What's up, vlog? Number my girl Jenny Janine in the background. Um, y'all, it's late, it's very late. As y'all can see, I'm in my bonnet and my bed clothes. Don't mind it. I've already been to work and everything else. It is Monday, May the thirteenth, and we are starting off the vlog at seven thirty-four. I'm not sure if y'all can see, but seven thirty-four. I'm starting off the vlog. Like I said, it's late. Um. Been to work, picked up the kids from daycare, picked them up from school, came home, we all got washed up, fed them, and they're actually upstairs winding down the school in the morning. Um, I don't, I didn't really have nothing planned. I wasn't even going to pick up the camera, but I haven't been on, or I haven't vlogged in a couple of weeks, let's say a couple of months. So yeah, I wanted to go ahead and just pick up the camera and say what's up. Before I even get any further into the video, if you are new here, my name is Alice Cherie. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you can notify every time your girl drop a banger. And if you're a returning subscriber, hey boo, what's up gang? What's the deal? Your girl is back in the flesh. Back in the flesh. Um, so yeah, like I said, it's late. It's only 7.35. Um, I have two baskets of clothes that sit right here in my hallway in front of my washroom because, of course, I washed clothes on yesterday. Oh, happy Mother's Day, everyone that's out there all the dog moms, all the step moms, all the moms to be, all the moms in heaven. Hopefully, everybody had a good Mother's Day on yesterday. Um, I actually had a good Mother's Day. Um, I actually pretty much stayed in the house. My husband cooked some steak and shrimp on the grill for me. We had some loaded mashed potatoes. We had some roasted corn. And like I said, we just pretty much stayed in the house. It was pouring down rain out here. And this year was the first year I celebrated Mother's Day without my mom. Um, I'm pretty sure some of y'all have already watched that video that I posted a couple of months ago. I lost my mom last year um, in August. So yeah, it was a tough one yesterday, but my husband and my kids made the best out of it i made the best out of it um so yeah this is probably going to be like a weekly vlog i just wanted to pick up the camera like i said i haven't vlogged in months i haven't vlogged in weeks so yeah i just wanted to just pick up the camera um i know i got some things planned this weekend me and my daughter have a hair appointment um coming up and then we also got a grad a graduation dinner as well um so yeah, what else? What else do I need to update y'all on? Um, I don't know. I don't know. Good morning. It is the next day. It is Tuesday. It is currently 712. This traffic um, that I am currently stuck in. I've already dropped the kids off um, to daycare. So check and next stop is to work. Y'all, tell me why it is a whole cyber truck. It's a whole cyber truck. Now look at this cyber truck. Look at this. I've never seen one in person, so this is my first time seeing one. So excuse me if I'm a little geek. But y'all, look at this cyber truck. But but back to what I was saying. Good morning. It is the next day. It is Tuesday. Um, it is currently 7:12, and I am stuck in traffic. I am stuck in traffic. I didn't pick y'all up last night because I didn't fold those clothes that I was talking about folding. So I guess I'm gonna have to do that today. I know I need to do that. So that's probably going to be something that I'll have to do when I get off. Um, hopefully everybody is having a nice Tuesday. As I mentioned last night, I got a hair appointment, and I cannot wait. I've been looking crazy and looking rough. As y'all can see, the new growth has been new growing, like has been really growing. I need to wash so my hair's a little dirty. <clears throat> so I'm excited to get that done. Ooh, Ooh y'all, I just witnessed a whole wreck. And I got that on camera. 
even though that van was in the wrong, their van should never jumped over in front of that car like that. I can't believe I just cut that on camera. Yeah, I'm in disbelief. I really caught that on camera. And I forgot to mention, um, this week at my job, y'all, we are celebrating employee appreciate. It's what it's employee appreciation week this week, and your girl is on the engagement committee. So me and my other uh, coworker, we actually planned out this whole week. This is the first time we've planned out something like this. So. Um, yesterday for Monday we did um, like we catered breakfast for all the employees um, which is pretty good I'm not sure if y'all I'm pretty sure some of y'all have heard about Corn Corners Bakery I think I'm saying it right if I'm not excuse me that I butchered it um, and then today we are actually giving the employees name plaques like for their desk with their name and their job title on it um, so I thought that would be something cute. And then um, tomorrow we did a snack. We are catering. Um, I think I can't remember if it's Cold Stone or either Marble Slab. But I know my coworker wanted to do an ice cream bar. So I, it was either out of those two. I can't remember um, which, which ice cream place we picked. Um, sorry, I'm not really focusing on the camera. I'm really focused on this traffic because people are jumping in front of people as y'all seen in the Previous clip I witnessed a whole wreck. So yeah um, And then Thursday um, Will be another gift giving day Which we're going to be gifting all the employees um, like work tote bags with their um, initial on them uh, for instance since of course, my name is Alice. It starts with A. I got a bag that says A on it. And then we're also going to gift them um, hidden blankets. Um, of course, because we work in a doctor's office and we're not able to have heaters. They're like cracking down on all of that. So why not gift the employees with heaters? Because, baby, we be in the freezing. It be cold in there. Like, it be really cold in there. And Friday, we're going to cater saltgrass for lunch. Um, so, yeah, I just wanted to let y'all know. I don't think I told y'all, so I wanted to go ahead and tell y'all about that. But let me go ahead and get up off this camera because, baby, like I said, traffic is really trafficking and these people do not care. Girl, I know you want it. You know I want it. Yeah, she keeps me low. Hotter. It's like roughly like 12.05. Um, we had a medication rep. They had brought some Mediterranean food, and I don't eat that, so I'm going to go grab one for the box. It is a nice day outside, y'all. Like, it is a really nice day. It's pretty. The sun out. It's not too hot. We got a little breeze going on or whatever, but I just want to check in with y'all listening to my music so i just check back in with y'all whenever i get my food yeah i'm gonna fix 
show. Hey y'all, good afternoon. Y'all know what time it is when you see the bonnet and the moo moo. Y'all already know what time it is. Um, of course I'm at home. I'm actually loading up my dishwasher because I'm about to cook like a little quick din din for the kids. Um, nothing major. My husband took out some chicken breast, so I'll probably fry those up. We have some leftover mashed potatoes. Um, lo loaded. We have some leftover loaded mashed potatoes in the refrigerator, so that's gonna be a side. And then uh, we also have like little mini personal size cups of little mac and cheese. If the kids want mac and cheese, then they have mashed potatoes or mac and cheese. If they want both, they can have both. But we're not gonna waste no food. Um, so yeah, just go in my dishwasher so I can go ahead and season up my chicken. Get that out the way. How every day, how everybody day went today. My day, y'all, and it was all right. It wasn't too busy and it was not slow. My phone barely rung today, y'all. Like it barely rung. Oh, um, I think I mentioned to y'all earlier that this week is my uh, job's employee appreciation week and of course your girl is on the engagement committee and today we gift our employees with little um not little but this name plaques y'all mine's is so cute i'll probably insert a picture somewhere here on the screen to show y'all because of course i love mine's at home not at home love mine's at work on my desk but I'll insert a picture of what my guest nameplate looked like on the screen. Um, but other than that, I ain't doing nothing. I might tackle those two basket of clothes that I was telling y'all about yesterday. Because I didn't do it last night. And I need to get those clothes out those baskets so I can have my baskets back. Because one of them is my daughter's dirty clothes basket and one of them is my dirty clothes basket. And uh... I'm tired of seeing my clothes in my bathroom on the floor. So I need to fold those clothes. All right, so got my seasoned chicken here. I just pretty much seasoned it with some garlic powder, some lorry seasoning, um, some onion powder, lemon pepper, a little paprika. And then, of course, I base it with some regular yellow mustard. Um, that's actually... Let me get over here. I'm actually going to fill my pan up with some oil. Put it on. Let that get hot. So I'm just let this go ahead and get hot. Flour up, well get my flour and stuff for my chicken together. And then, that's pretty much. All right, so I got my flour here, some fresh flour. Y'all let me know in the comments if y'all season y'all flour or not before y'all stick y'all chicken in there. Me, when I was growing up, my mama, my grandmother, sister, aunts, baby, everybody in my family used to season their flour before they even stuck their chicken or whatever they was frying, they made sure they seasoned that flour. What they say, if you ain't sneezing, it ain't seasoned. Yeah. So I'm gonna just go ahead and just season my flour with the same pretty much season. Not well, it's pretty much the same season that I season my chicken with, but I'm not gonna put everything in there. Pretty much I just put the lorry seasoning in there. I did the garlic powder. I added a little paprika that's in there. I'm not gonna add the lemon pepper. Um, I'm not, and I'ma just top on here and give it a little shake and shake. My grease seems like it's almost about hot, but I'm probably gonna let it keep warming up for about like two more minutes. I'm gonna go ahead and put my chicken in here. Let's go ahead and coat my chicken so I can drop it in the fryer. Quick, a little quick and easy meal.
what's up y'all what's up vlog welcome back it is a couple of days later it's actually saturday may the 18th it is currently 1205 y'all i'm actually on my way back home from the hair shop as you can see your girl got her hair did because in the last couple of clips i was looking like who did it and what um i'm actually on my way home so my husband can trim the back of my undercut and so i can get ready for this graduation dinner we was invited to today i think it's supposed to be at the sugar factory um which i'm excited for because i've never been to the sugar factory heard good things about it heard that the food was good but baby i heard it was also expensive um i was rushing out the house so bad this morning y'all i forgot to grab my apple watch I wanted to put my lashes on, at least try to get myself pre-together, pre-together, if I said that right, if that makes sense. I wanted to at least have my lashes done. I wanted to do like a little soft beat, but then I'm glad I didn't do a soft beat, of course, because I had my hair washed, and I ain't want my makeup beat um, with the shampoo and stuff like that, so that's good I didn't do that. But yeah, I at least wanted to have my lashes done, and I didn't put my lashes on before. I actually wanted to stop off at Starbucks and try the new summer refresher drinks with y'all. Didn't have the time to do that. So if I don't do that um, today, I'll probably do it sometime this week or next week or either tomorrow, actually. Um, what else? I don't think I have nothing else planned for today. I'm not even sure what I'm going to put on for this graduation dinner. The outfit, I wouldn't even say it's an outfit. What I have on now, it was something, an idea of what I wanted to wear. It is nice outside, y'all. It is nice like the sun is out it's not too high it's not too cold the wind is breezing and i think the highest well right now it's supposed to well the highest is 90 and right now it's 84 according to my phone so yeah it's gonna be a pretty day baby and i'm trying to have a leg side so i don't know if i want to wear shorts or put a dress on i know i'm not gonna put, i don't want to put no jeans on because it's gonna be hot today so i guess i'll just check back in with y'all whenever i get to the house try to figure out what i'm gonna wear um, do my last, do my makeup. I got roughly around maybe an hour and a half, maybe two hours to get myself together and try to figure out what I'm going to wear.
what's up y'all so i have pulled up to starbucks <laughs> it is a little line i was debating if i would actually wanted to stop but i really want to try this drink with y'all y'all so i'm very excited i'm car number four in line and i think it's like four of the cars on the other side of the store oh starbucks is always packed and it's, this one is always packed because it's the only starbucks that we have in our neighborhood i think the closest one is probably another 30 minutes out and yeah so it's packed um let me go ahead and pull up my starbucks order if y'all tried this new summer um summer berry drink from starbucks y'all let me know in the comments on y'all thoughts about it um i heard it was good so i want to try for myself but this line is moving pretty quick it's moving pretty quick can I get this uh, Grande Summer Berry drink with lemonade yes. refresher? And then um, those do everything oh, okay. that stuff up. Okay, and then Alice would be the name. Alice? Mm -hmm. okay. And that's why you wanted to mm -hmm. Yes, ma'am. All right, Alice. And they'll see you from the total 698, okay? Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she walked up on me and scared me. <laughs> Baby, she came out and took my order, y'all. When I said she scared me, she scared me. We're getting closer. We're getting closer. This shit better be good for my six dollars that I'm at the, my, that I'm about to spend. This better be delicious. So this is better be worth it. This better be worth it. Cause I didn't set in this hotline. Okay, I'm crazy, man. I didn't set in this line for this drink. It better be worth it. And that's why I only got a grande. I didn't want to waste my money on it, especially if it was nasty. Berry, summer berry. Matter of fact, let me look up. Let me look up this drink and see what's all up in this summer berry Starbucks refresher. So it's a. It says it's a. Come on. It's a summer blend. A sweet summer blend of raspberry, blueberries, blackberries. I'm not a big fan of blackberries, but we're going to see. Um, flavor shaken with ice poured over raspberry flavored pearls that deliver a duplicate and delicious burst of the summer fun. So, we shall see. Alright y'all, I'm the next car. I'm the next car. Let me get my, pull up this app again. Y'all look at all these different stickers. Y'all look at the stickers that they have while you're waiting in line. And then they have some more on that pole as well over there. Y'all see what I'm talking about? I'm in line and this is the line to get in line up for Starbucks. This is ridiculous. It's ridiculous. And I'm still here, but I'm car number two to get my drink. Come on. Y'all, Starbucks is jumping today on a Sunday, baby. This is like the new Chick-fil-A spot on Sunday because Chick-fil-A is closed on Sunday. <laughs> but we're pulling up. I'm getting my drink. Hopefully it's cute. Not hopefully it's cute, but it's blue. For Alice? Yes, and I want a skin. The lines are ridiculous and people are just steady coming in. Hopefully I'm able to get out because the way I have to get out is the way that you have to come in, y'all. And it's a very, very narrow area. Let me show y'all. Y'all see that? Goods are secured. Now, who gonna let me out? Who is going to let me out? So I want to pull over and try this with y'all. So this is what it's giving. It's giving the redness at the bottom, like a light color blue. And then I got the one with lemonade. And then I got a grande. So it smells good. It smells fruity. Okay, Starbucks. This is actually not bad. And then they give you this 
big old straw that they would normally give you for like bubble tea. If y'all ever had tried bubble tea before, I've never tried it, but I've seen the straw, or like a smoothie straw. Like this big old straw. Oh, drop my straw. Um, yeah, let's give it a little swirly swirl, spinny spin. Y'all, that is actually not bad. That is pretty, pretty damn good. I, I would write this a 9 out of 10. It's good. Mm. But with the... But with this thick old straw, baby, I just swallowed one of them bread things. Starbucks gonna kill people with this straw. But yeah. Overall, I rate it a 10 out of 10. A 10 out of 10. So, this might be it for this vlog. I've tried the Starbucks drink with y'all and everything. I'll probably go ahead and end out this vlog. I'll probably go home, clean up my house, cook dinner for tonight. Um, so yeah, thank y'all for watching. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure y'all hit that notification bell so you'll get notified every time your girl drop a video.